Whenever you're graphing an absolute value f function, if the function within the absolute values is linear, then you're going to have a v. Okay. Now if there's a number being added or subtracted from it, this is going to cause a horizontal shift. And if there's a number outside of the absolute value being added or subtracted, that is going to give you a vertical shift. So when it's inside the absolute value, if it's negative, that means you're going to go to the right. And if it's positive, that means you're going to go to the left. So in this case, I'm going to need to go to the left too. So it's going to be centered around the y, e I'm sorry, the x equals 2 line. But then the negative 3 means I need to go down 3. So the v is originally centered here. So I'm going to go over 2 and down 3. Then I just need to draw my rays of my v. And the slope of this one should be 1. And the slope of this one should be negative 1. So um, that will help you to be able to draw this.